डॉक्टर जी बालगणेशन सीनियर टेक्निकल ऑफिसर सेंट्रल वर्कशॉप आई एम कोऑर्डिनेटिंग फॉर वर्कशॉप ट्रेनिंग टू ऑल फर्स्ट ईयर बीटेक स्टूडेंट्स सो वी आर ट्रेनिंग अबाउट थाउजेंड स्टूडेंट्स बी टेक एंड डिलीवरी स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ आई मद्रास एंड वी ऑफर टू कोर्सेस वन कोर्स रिलेटेड टू ऑल वर्किंग विद स्टूडेंट्स वर्किंग विद डिफरेंट मेटीरियल्स मेशीन एंड इक्विपमेंट टू मेक द स्ट्रक्चर अंडर कोर्स Uh, after developing any equipment or machine, we need to analyze. Right. Actually, my the help of uh, power tools Our aim is to butter the two plastic together and welding by using a filler rod. The filler rod also thermoplastic material. Then another sheet and provide small gap in between this, not even 0.5 millimeter. So initially we are going to hold the filler rod 90 degree to the base. The gun angle is 40 millimeter. So the welding is made by previous batch key. Just break it and see. Then only you can come to know. By the time of welding, yes. So you may, if I done the welding, two sides, I will give it a chance. You can't be able to broken by manual. Even if you broken, it never broken at the welded area. Uh, this is like a metal job. Uh, Student used to come like uh, three classes, so she used to finish up that those product uh, during that three classes. So when we go to the uh, machine shop, then we can see that the uh, what they are doing in the machine shop in the various. Uh, Giving it a shape like this uh, so that uh, it has a different diameter, a different length. Our first length, 20 mm, has a diameter of uh, uh, has a diameter of around 18 mm, and uh, another second length, 35 mm. This one is Gaurav. Gaurav, Gaurav, what are you doing here? What is this? Uh, Machine is called. We are doing turning, a process called turning, in which uh, we reduce diameter such and such. This uh, diameter, I mean, reducing this diameter uh, yes. by passing this. Manually, it's 
possible for uh, doing 2D profile only this weekend. If you want to uh, do 3D profile, we have a software, Mastercam software. It gen generally, that software will generate the code. After that, we copy that code and then input that code. This is the one of American based software. The machine, uh, the, all the machines are uh, just Bangalore based only. So that here. X, Y is same profile, but after reference is same only. But the, all the tools are different height. So we are using the offset here. Four tools for different height. Training kit, so first of all, training kit. In this, uh, they are going to operate a hydraulic motor. How it works, how to turn the hydraulic motor in a hydraulic system. Uh, they have to connect the circuits as per the circuits. They have given the circuits, this is the circuit. So, from as per the circuit, they have to connect. They learn about hydraulic motor function as well as the controlling the speed. Speed of the motor will be controlled. Eh? How fast the motor can be controlled how slow, like that, uh, variable speeds you will learn. So, so that later on you can utilize this hydraulic motor in uh, real applications. Sure. Now only model is learning. So hydraulic motor can be operated like this. Right? So by using this knowledge you can utilize in your project or later on in the practicals. My name is Aditya Kumar. I am from the Department of Engineering Physics and today I am in the Instrumentation Communications Workshop. So today we have set up the circuit over here. We are using a H212E encoder, transmitting the, the, the data by, by an RF transmitter, which is received by this receiver and decoded in this H12D uh, decoder. Now currently we are using a hoist to switch input. So you want to sw switch the inputs, as soon as you switch an input here, this bulb will light up over there. And that indicates how we are using the radio signals to transmit information inputs from here to there. So I can start by connecting the wires. This is where the 
the signal sent over here will be decoded. First, it's going to receive it over here. This is called the RS receiver. Then the signal which is received over here will be decoded by this. And then whatever output has to be displayed will be displayed by this circuit. And now we switch this one on. And this one on as well. This is the up button and this one lights up over here. As you can see, uh, this signal will go to this one. It will be transmitted by this wire. It will come back here. Now from here the information, yes, yeah, this is the receiver. It will come back here to the decoder. This shows the receiver signal. And then goes back to output one, which then transfers it to this. So it's a very it's a very simple circuit, but it looks rather complicated this way. But yes. And now you can do it for another button. The right. This bulb is a bit defective, so it's very dim. But if you focus, you can see that actually this one's lighting up, which means the output is correct. And that concludes everything there is to say about this particular circuit. Thank you so much. Amplify the power of this one, and I can have something which communicates from this side and introduce the other side. Yeah. It's primarily for communication. So they are involved with the electrical workshop module, and they are doing a practical test on two blade central. So from this uh, electrical module, they will uh, understand how to use the electrical tools as well as how to follow the safety instructions and safety precautions and it will be most useful either at uh, inside the institute or outside the institute they can handle very comfortably. Anish? Anish Mandari. This uh, workshop we have learned how to handle uh, electrical equipment like uh, primpers and pliers and all and how to like what are the safety precautions and how to connect wires and circuits and all. Most of the time they were going to deal with the electronics, electrical as well as the mechanical part. We use in our uh, domestic as well as in our office, in our, it's a two-blade circuit. We will be using in our daily life. Whenever uh, at, our, at home or and at office or wherever the two-blade becomes faulty, they are uh, in a position to repair that uh, circuit. And they have to get tested here. Yeah. Turo karo bhaiya. Okay. Okay.